Uh, how's Facebook thinking about uh, its own role in creating this platform for uh, entrepreneurship around the world? I know that's something that you've been thinking a lot about. To me, entrepreneurship is about creating change, not just creating companies. And you know, the, the most effective entrepreneurs that, who, who I've met care deeply about some mission and some change that they're trying to create. And often they don't even start because they're trying to create a company. Right? And you know, that's how, how I think about um, you know, my connection to, to all, all of us here is, you know, when I was getting started, I, um, you know, I, wanted, I care deeply about giving everyone uh, a voice right? and giving people the tools to share everything that they cared about and uh, bringing a community together. And you know, it started small in, in one university. And I didn't think it was going to be a company at the time. Um, as a matter of fact, I was pretty convinced that at some point someone would build um, something like this for the world. But uh, you know, I thought that that would be some other company that you know already had thousands of engineers and was used to building stuff for hundreds of millions of people around the world. And you know, what ended up happening was um, you know that no one built it. Right? So we just kind of kept on going. Right? I mean, people said it each step along the way. Um, you know what you're doing. All right, maybe college students like it, but no one else is going to like it. And you know, there's not going to be any money in doing this. So, all right, so you only really do it if you care, right? If you're passionate about doing it. And you know, then it started growing, and people said it would be a fad, and it would never be a good business. But you know, you, you keep going because you care, uh, not because you're you're trying to create a business. Um, and you know, then there's the shift to mobile, where people thought that you know, it, it wouldn't be a sustainable business, and um, you know, it, through each of these things, you, you, the, the entrepreneurs who I think build things that last for a long time keep going because they care fundamentally about the change that they're trying to create in the world, um, and they're not in it just to, to build a company. And you know, I, I carry that with me today. You know, so you know, today we have, you know, we live in a world with more than seven billion people, uh, but more than four billion uh, of us are not on the internet. And you know, we talk about having an equal opportunity to be able to create a change in the world. And you know, I think that's a really hard thing to do if, uh, if you don't have access to some of the basic infrastructure uh, and, and technical tools that are necessary to, uh, to build this kind of, um, these kind of technical products. So you know, I, I kind of think about what we're doing today um, very similarly to, to how I thought about where we were at the beginning. You know, it's, uh, you know, I get people all the time who come to me and say, all right, well, you're investing billions of dollars in trying to uh, put internet connectivity in, in places where you know, we don't get paid for it. Um, it's not something that, uh, we'll, that we'll make any money from for a very long period of time if it works out. But you know, it's this deep belief that you're trying to make a change, you're trying to connect people in the world. And I really do believe that if you do something good and if you help people out, then eventually some portion of that good will come back to you. And you may not know up front what it's going to be, uh, but that's just been the guiding principle for me in the work that we've done. And I hope that some of the work that we do uh, can play a role in empowering you and so many more entrepreneurs to build uh, the next great companies. Excellent.